Hey, it's Shell Casing Kid. I wanted to do a video where I compare the size of modern money with a half cent and a large cent because before I found them, I didn't know um, exactly what size I was looking for. So if you compare this half cent to our modern change, um, you start getting in the range right around a nickel, but a nickel, a modern nickel is actually smaller than a half cent and a quarter is right about the same size as a half cent. Half cent might be slightly smaller, but it's right around a quarter, the size of a quarter. And you notice too, when I put it on the side, they don't have a reeded edge. Now, the large cent, I think they don't either, but I'm not quite sure. Uh, this is a matron head from 1833. This is probably the best looking one I have. These are large, so they're bigger than a quarter. They're only a little bit smaller than a half dollar coin, like a modern half dollar coin. So when someone says they found a large cent, they're not kidding. It, it, it's a large coin. And uh, I imagine carrying a lot of these in your pocket would probably be a pain in the old times, but that would mean you were rich, right? Or you had at least had some money. But hope that helps everyone. If you're looking for them, large cent, almost the size of a half dollar. And the half cent is right around the exact same size as a quarter. As a matter of fact, when I was digging this one last year, I thought I had found a quarter, but I was just thinking Washington's facing the wrong direction. And when I took a closer look at it, boy, was I surprised. Because it's a half cent from 1803. All right, everyone, um, check out my video this upcoming Wednesday, and thanks for watching.